Let's talk about a manhua called Worthless Profession, Dragon Tamer. Here in the start of the manhua, we see a narration. It goes like this. This is a world where elements of virtual gaming have merged with reality. Various new professions have evolved, and people can change their professions to gain more powerful abilities. There are countless ruins and dungeons, numerous mysterious realms, and monsters. In turn, individuals can also obtain experience points, materials, and even equipment to strengthen themselves by hunting monsters. However, no matter how fierce the monsters are, they pale compared to that odd, inspiring existence of mysterious yet rare, powerful, like a deity's, dragons. Then, in a school called Dragon Kingdom, third school, here we see, a teacher was saying to his students, Attention, everyone. Today's profession awakening ceremony will not only affect your ability to pass the university entrance exam, but it also relates to your future success. Although, in theory, the result of profession awakening is randomly determined, everyone must have confidence in themselves. As long as you have strong determination, each one of you can awaken a combative profession, and that kid with the silent text bubble is our main character. After hearing what that teacher said, our main character thought while making a fist. Finally, the day has come. I am Lu Fan a person who was transmigrated to this world from a place called Blue Planet three years ago. During these three years in this world, I have gained a fairly clear understanding of this world. There are many kinds of professions in this world, which can be roughly categorized into three types. At the top are combative professionals, which include warriors, mages, archers, and so on. They use powerful abilities to explore unknown realms, obtain equipment, and receive generous rewards. This profession is most coveted. Next are the reinforcing professionals, such as enchanters, alchemists, and the like. They can create special items with powerful effects. However, since purchasing materials incur significant expenses, generally without the support of a large family, it is simply not possible to nurture any decent reinforcing professional. Lastly, at the bottom of the pyramid are subsistence professions such as chefs, herbalists, miners, etc. These professions are the future for the majority of people, ordinary individuals who work hard and strive to make a living. My aunt, Han Ki, is a chef. She toils hard daily, supporting my education with her small steamed bun shop. Although she is only 8 years older than me, she supports me selflessly. I see all the hard work she puts in. In order to survive in this world and to provide a better life for my aunt, I must awaken as a combative professional. Then it looks like someone called that teacher. And then the teacher said, Uh, yes, I understand. Then the teacher said to his students with an excited tone, Students, I just received news that the awakening platform has been built and the awakening ceremony is about to begin. Hearing that, all the students started shouting and cheering. But for some reason, our main character Lu Fan was silent while all the other students started going to the awakening place. Then this teacher come close to Lu Fan and asked him, Lu Fan, what's wrong? And said, you're the top student in our section. There is no need to be anxious. But our main character was silent for another reason. And the reason was the legendary system. And it looks like Lu Fan awakened the legendary system. Seeing the system with the shocking face, Lu Fan was like, what? The system then said to Lu Fan, congratulations, the super treasure map system has been successfully activated. Then suddenly, the teacher with a loud voice asked Lu Fan, oi, Lu Fan, are you listening to me? And Lu Fan was like, Huh? Then Lu Fan suddenly started running, he said to his teacher while running, Sorry, teach. I'll get going. While going to that awakening place, Lu Fan thought, Finally, is here. How can there exist a transmigrator without a system? But what use does this system have? I'll think about it later. Right now, the courier ceremony is more important. Then, in the place where the awakening of the students would take place, after looking at the awakening crystal, the students were like, is that the awakening crystal? It's my first time seeing it. I'm so nervous. And the teacher was like, silence, everyone. Then one student suddenly said, 
How great would it be if I awaken a hidden combative profession? Won't I become a powerful person admired by millions? And Lu Fan also come to this place. Then another student said, Dude, you're sleep talking in broad daylight. Hidden combative professions are rare in the entire school. I will pray to my ancestors if I could just end up with a subsistence profession. Then this old man said to the students, The awakening ceremony is about to begin. This is the priest who will be hosting this year's awakening ceremony. Hearing that, the students were like, So, they're the ones in charge of the awakening? Looking at that priest, Lu Fan thought, A priest? The aura of a combative professional is truly different. Then one student suddenly said, such a domineering aura, I wish I could awaken such a presence. And in that moment, the system suddenly notified Lu Fan and said, you have acquired a new skill, eye of appraisal. Hearing that, Lu Fan was like, appraisal. Then he used this appraisal skill on that priest, and suddenly all the information about that priest pooped up in front of him. Seeing this, Lu Fan was like, is this information of the priest? After seeing the net worth of that priest, Lu Fan got so shocked that his jaw almost fell to the ground, and he was like, 5 million dragon coins? And in that moment, that old man suddenly shouted and said to the students, quiet. And all the students become silent instantly. Then this old man said, students whose names are called, please come up to the stage. And Lu Fan was still thinking about that priest's net worth, and he was like, even if she sells buns for her entire life, my aunt won't be able to earn this much money. Then that old man suddenly called out to a student named Jiang Tao. Seeing that student, all the other guys were like, Jiang Tao, isn't he the top student in our section? I wonder if he will awaken as a combative professional? You bet. All his attributes are so freaking high. You should know that although awakenings are mostly random, the higher one's attributes, the more likely one can awaken as a combative professional. And all the girls also started cheering for this guy. Then this guy went into that awakening stage and stood there while that priest started using his power on the student. And that awakening stone also started shining. And suddenly, a fireball popped up in front of this student on top of that awakening stone. Seeing this, all the other students were like, it's a fireball. He must have awakened as a pyromancer. Wow. Jiang Tao is amazing. He really became a combative professional. I'm so envious of him. He has a bright future ahead. Then, with an arrogant look, this guy started showing of his pyrokinesis power. And all the students started cheering for this guy. Seeing him, Lu Fan thought, that's it. If I can awaken as a combative professional, I can say goodbye to this distressed life. And that old man suddenly got angry and said to everyone, I said, Silence, next one. Hurry. After that, another guy went to the stage and awakened herbalist skill and was like, Herbalist, huh? At least I can carry on my family business. Then after awakening his talent, another bald guy said, Taylor, no, I don't like it at all. Then this almost dead kid said after awakening his talent, minor, no, I don't want that. Looking at them, Lu Fan said, it seems that combative professions are indeed the minority, and the majority still end up with subsistence professions. Then he thought, awakening as a combative profession signifies unlimited possibilities for the future. While most people awaken as subsistence professionals, they are destined to live an ordinary life. Then another student said to Lu Fan, well, this is still considered a good outcome. Take a look at Li Ping from section 3. Her family was already struggling. And now, she had awakened as a reinforcing professional who would need a lot of money to nurture. It would have been better for her to awaken as a subsistence professional. She could have at least gained some specialized skills. Hearing that, Lu Fan thought, My family is also struggling. If I end up with the reinforcing profession, what am I gonna do? Then that old man called out to Lu Fan and said, Lu Fan. Lu Fan from section 25, get to the platform. Then Lu Fan started going up to the stage. Seeing him, some girls were like, this young man is also quite handsome. I wonder what profession he will awaken. After standing on that stage, Lu Fan thought while touching that awakening stone. At this point, being nervous is useless. And as usual, that priest started using his power in that awakening stone, 
and that stone started shining brightly. And Lu Fan was also watching this with anticipation. But suddenly, a huge dragon eye appeared on top of everyone in that place, and the entire place started shaking. Seeing this, all the students were like, What's going on? An earthquake? Then all of a sudden, a huge light fell on Lu Fan from the sky. And a dragon like figure also appeared on top of Lu Fan. Seeing this, everyone present there got shocked, and they were like, Is that a dragon? Lu Fan's awakening actually summoned a dragon. Wow, this is a phenomenon that only occurs when a hidden profession appears. Hidden profession? Is it for real? Then one female teacher said to that bald teacher, Teacher Lee, your section actually produced the first hidden professional in our school. Well done. Then this bald teacher said, if he awakens as the strongest hidden professionals, like Dragon Blood Warrior or Dovatin Vok Mage, he can become a new powerhouse in the Dragon Kingdom and make history. It's been 10 years since someone awakened as a Dragon Blood Warrior. Then this female teacher said, that person is now a top tier expert in the Dragon Kingdom. And then, the moment this bald teacher was about to say something, that dragon suddenly rushed towards Lu Fan while opening its mouth. But, because of a barrier or something, it vanished. And then that awakening stone also stopped shining, and everything calmed down. Then this old man asked Lu Fan with a rushed tone while grabbing his shoulders. Kid, which profession did you awaken? Is it Dragon Blood Warrior or Dovatin Vok Mage? Then with a disappointed face, Lu Fan said, I am a dragon tamer. Hearing that, all the teachers and students present there got shock. Then this old man said with a trembling voice, How could the outcome of such a grand spectacle be the most worthless profession, dragon tamer? And with that, this video is finished. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to my channel for more entertaining videos like these.